Are there any observations that we've made over the years in neurons or in any other cells where you know the microtubules seem to be in the cell in a way that can't be explained by just serving as a as a, a skeleton for the cell? Is there anything that that people like you have looked at them and said, okay, these microtubules seem to be in this part of the cell and they're sort of oriented in a way that we can't really just explain away with, you know, they're a structural component of the cell or they're going to help the cell cycle or something like that. That's a great question again. And um, what's exciting is that, you know, much like the mitochondria that has been, you know, coined as the powerhouse of the cell, and we're starting to see that it does more than that, mm -hmm. the the microtubule kind of got like a bad rap in the sense that it's just structural. Yeah. But it's definitely more than just structural. We see this also in magnetic stimulation. For example, um, when in researchers have shown that if you apply certain intensities of magnetic fields or electric fields, these microtubules move and they align. So the fact that they, it's not just that they are there for structure, just for support beams, they seem to be responsive to applied physical signals. Hmm. So that kind of then begs the question, are they moving and providing structure because of environmental signals? And they're, they're kind of then altering cell signaling or is it vice versa? So they are kind of like a physical antenna to propagate external physical signals, electrical, magnetic have been shown. And now we're trying to see, is it photonic as well?